We're uh, getting into the hotter weather now, and nothing is uh, is as good by the pool as you know crushable, fun, sparkling cocktails. So I'm gonna make these these drinks and these guys. But if you know you have these ingredients at home and you uh, like a larger format, like a bread solo cup, go ahead, do whatever you got to do. So we're gonna make this really, really easy because. As interested as I am at the bar of making very esoteric things, at home I like stuff that's really, really easy and delicious. So we're gonna put some ice in these guys. Then we're gonna put, I have this Rose Lambrusco. The brand name is Labrusca, so it's Labrusca Lambrusco. Uh, I think they must have done that just to be confusing. Uh, it's pretty and it's rosé and it's a little drier than, than the, the rosso, the red Lambrusco that you're probably used to, to thinking of as uh, Lambrusco. Uh, but it's still not like 100%, it's not brute dry, certainly. Now, you can eyeball it, but I'm just going to do this to show you what it looks like. See, with ice, that's, that's just three ounces of wine. I don't think you're gonna be using this jigger at the house to uh, measure your wine. So three ounces on ice looks like a big, full um, wine glass. Then I'm gonna sneak in the bitters, actually. A couple of dashes of that in there, a couple of dashes in here. And then I like to use Peixo in this because it's lighter, it's brighter. Um, as opposed to a lot of other brands of uh, aromatic bitters, which lean on clove and allspice and these kind of dark woodsy spices that are delicious uh, for these springtime cocktails. I like to use lighter things. This has a lot more obvious gentian note, but anise kind of brighter notes. Um, these are gonna go really, really well with uh, the strawberry syrup we have. We're gonna do, you can call it a, a heavy quarter ounce, you can call it a light half ounce, or you can call it what it is, it's a third of an ounce of, of strawberry syrup there. And then, same, same for this watermelon. Give it just the quickest of spins. But be gentle with your um, with your spins because you don't want to lose all the bubbles. This is a frizzante wine. It's not a full-on spumante wine, so you want to you don't want to lose your your fizz. And then just a nice squeeze of lemon because the syrup has got sugar in it, and the Lambrusco is not uh, Lambrusco is not a, a fully dry wine, so. This really makes it more refreshing. So we got a little strawberry a sparkling thing and a little sparkling watermelon cocktail. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.